everybody. I'm Phyllis Davis and I am the Youth Services Manager at the Library Station. Today's STEAM Challenge is for kids in first grade and up and younger makers will want to grab a grown-up for some help. I call this one the That's the Way the Ball Bounces Challenge and to complete it you'll need a little bit of chemistry and a few things from home. Start by gathering a tablespoon of borax, a half cup of warm water, a measuring cup, a tablespoon, a bowl, some glitter or food coloring for a little shine or sparkle, and some plastic gloves to protect your hands. Go ahead and get started by taking that half cup of warm water and pouring it into your bowl. Then you're going to take a tablespoon of borax. You're going to pour it into the bowl and you're going to mix it up really well until all of the borax is dissolved. Finally, you're going to take that glue and I recommend strongly using Elmer's Clear or Elmer's Glitter Glue as it works best and you're gonna pour two tablespoons right into that borax mixture. Then you're gonna to start to squish it together. Be sure to put those gloves on your hands. The borax can be really hard on your hands and squish it and squish it and squish it. And when you first feel it, it's gonna feel kind of like slime because that's what this mixture really is, is a really thick extra dense version of slime. So you're gonna keep mushing and gushing and mixing it together until it forms a nice hard ball like this. And guess what? This is a bouncy ball and it really works. Should we see how it goes? I'm gonna make a little room on my table and I really hope it doesn't bounce crazy. Let's see, I'm just gonna do a little bounce and then when you try it at home, see if you can bounce it as high as you can. Are you ready? Let's do it. Did you see it? Yes, it works. If you like this project, I have an amazing book for you. It's written by another one of my favorite authors of science books. Her name is Janice Van Cleve. And this particular book is called Even More of Janice Van Cleve's Wild, Wacky, and Weird Chemistry Experiments. You can find this book on the Hoopla app or just stop by the library and we have lots of Janice Van Cleve's books in our collection. Now, if you make one of these bouncy balls, we would love to see it. So just grab your grown-up and ask them to either tag us on Facebook at thelibrary.org or on Instagram at Springfield Green County Library or they can email us at imagine at thelibrary.org. And don't forget, we have lots more STEM challenges and lots of other great content at the library's website at thelibrary.org. Thanks and goodbye.